Hi guys and welcome to another Sims free play video. This video is going to be all about the preparing for the preteens quest. Now this uh, quest becomes available on level 15 and there is no time limit so it's a fantastic task. I love it. It's so nice to have um, a no time limit on one of these things. But anyway, let's get into the tasks that you need to complete the first one you need to complete is to build simtown elementary so hmm it's about time toddlers were able to get a little older don't you think preteen sims are great they can go to school karate class ballet and much more this is going to be fun let's start preparing your preteen sims by building simtown elementary so obviously to build simtown elementary you need to head out onto the town map and of course with all of these builds depending upon how many you've already built that will change the cost and the time that it will take you to build the build that you're going to do so for me mine costs 20 simoleons and one day four hours which is quite a long time but we'll go ahead and we'll get that building up and starting and let's remember there is no time period on here so it's okay we can relax we'll come back when that is built so my Simtown Elementary is now built, so let's go ahead and look at the next task, which is to purchase a study desk. Okay, so perfect. Now that the school is built, your preteens are going to need somewhere to study. The more they study, the better their grades and the more pocket money they'll earn. So it's totally worth it. You'll find it in the preteen section of the home store. So let's head on over. I think we'll go to the house where we've got the toddlers living at the moment. Just collect my daily reward there. And we'll go ahead and purchase a study desk. Now, don't do this early. If you are in the process of building your Simtown Elementary, don't purchase a study desk because it won't count towards this task. You have to do it when it comes up. So here we go in the preteen section. So as you can see, there's different prices. We'll just go for the, the cheapy one. And there is no room, of course, in my <laughs> uh, little toddler's bedroom there. But we'll plop it down in the hallway. So there we go, we have purchased a study desk. The next thing we need to do is to purchase a preteen bookshelf. So again, that will be in the preteen section of the home store. Again, like with the other one, we'll just get rid of that bed because we've got no space for <laughs> anything else. We don't want the toddler stuff. We're going on to preteens now. Um, yeah, like before, don't purchase these things beforehand. They won't count for this task. You have to do it whilst you're actually doing the task so again there is different uh costs with bookcases uh i just recommend that you just go for the cheaper one unless you've got a load of money but just go for the the four thousand one because to be honest that's quite expensive anyway <laughs> so let's place that down task complete let's go ahead and see what our next task is so we need to read harry Harriet, no, I was going to say Harry Potter. It's not Harry Potter, it's Harriet Putner. Wow, this bookshelf is stocked full of all kinds of great reads. Well, let's go and get Joe Jonas. He's dad. He can go ahead and read Harriet Putner. Uh, and that takes four hours. So we will return when Joe has finished reading that. Where's he going to sit and read it? Um, he's going to sit in the baby's room. Oh, that's nice. Okay, we'll see you in a little bit, Joe. You get reading. So Joe has finished reading Harriet Putner. He now needs to read everything you need to know. What a great book. It's all about a sim who discovers the magical golfing powers before taking a train to Put-Put Castle Academy. I wonder what else preteens like. Hmm, I wonder where that story has come from. Um, yeah, so now we've got to read everything you need to know. And wow, that takes one day. Good job this task is unlimited time. We might as well just get Joe... Joan, I was going to say, Joe Jones to read that as well. Whilst he's in the reading mood, he can go ahead and read that and we'll be back in one whole day when he has finished doing that. So, Joe has finished reading everything you need to know. Took him a long time, a whole day. Now we need to buy a preteen bed. So, wow, there's some great information in here. Apparently, more than anything, preteens enjoy staying up late, sleeping in and plastering their walls with posters that's about right isn't it so again like with the other items that you've bought they will be in the home store in the preteen section and don't buy them early and also there'll be a few different varieties of ones that you can choose from obviously just choose whichever one you like and whatever your budget will allow i'm sticking with the the boy 
bluey type theme because my preteen is going to be a boy but that's complete now and let's go ahead and see what the next task is to buy a trampoline preteens also need entertainment the book with everything your sim needs to know suggested you get yourself a trampoline oh nice that'll be a uh, good for the preteens to play with so that again i'll keep saying it is in the preteen section of the home store and don't buy it early there are a few different trampolines that you can choose again the cheapest will do because nine thousand that's quite a lot of money to be honest for the trampoline and oh i've leveled up excellent let's just take a little look at what i get oh nice nice some nice new things for me to level up with there okay next one celebrate the trampoline you might not have any preteens to bounce on it but you need to go ahead and celebrate the trampoline that will take three hours and 40 minutes joe might as well do this whole task you know he is going to be the dad for this preteen so we'll head him head him out send him out to celebrate the trampoline and we'll be back when he has finished doing that so joe finished with his celebrating of the trampoline it's now time to cook some cheese and tomato on toast nice moves okay now that the trampoline you've got the trampoline ready we're going to need some snacks preteens love snacks so we need to go ahead and cook some cheese on toast so i'm just going to go and find my cook who i've got as the cook hobby oh no my place is too crowded right i need to sort this out go and find her and get her to cook some cheese on toast Okay, right, we've got David. Let's use David and get him to cook some cheese. It's cheese and tomato on toast. It only takes a minute, so that's quite good. Okay, David's finished. He's shouting, waving at us. He's cooked his cheese and tomato on toast. Oh, and he also got a gold chef's knife. Excellent. So let's have a little look what the next task is, is to watch a movie on TV. With all that trampolining and snacking happening, you're going to need a way to calm those excitable sims down. A nice relaxing movie would be just the thing. Better screen one for them. Okay, so we just head on over, watch a movie, which takes one hour, 50 minutes, was that? And we'll leave David doing that, and we will return when he's finished. So David has finished watching his movie on telly, so let's have a look at the next, next task. Ask advice from the thinking man. There are some who claim the statue in the park, the thinking man, knows ev absolutely everything in the universe. Long ago, a scientist carbon dated the statue and found that he not only predicts the Big Bang... Oh, yada, yada, yada. We need to go to the park and ask the thinking man for some advice. So let's head on over to the park now. Just uh, collect a few of these little things before we head over there. Every simoleon counts. And so the thinking man is up in the top right or top left corner of the park. I've got the dances that they're part of another quest, so you can just ignore them for now. Let's go ahead and click on the thinking man to so ask advice takes one whole day. So we'll leave him asking for his advice he's just wandering over there now what advice he thinks he's gonna get from a stone statue i'm not sure he looks slightly crazy but we'll leave him to it and we'll be back in a day so let's go ahead and see what advice the thinking man gave us that is now completed i can't imagine he gave us anything worth knowing oh no there you go be rude to the thinking man and the wisdom the thinking man had to impart is silence <laughs> There we go. Would we not predict that? That the um, the stone statue said nothing. So now what we need to do is to be rude to the thinking man, which takes another day. So we'll leave him being rude and we shall be back. Oh, it's a bit laggy. We'll be back when he is finished being rude to him. So we have now finished being rude to thinking man. So the next task we need to do is to play Sims on a PC. Okay, so let's head on over to, I'm not sure which of my houses has um, has a computer. I think Edward might have one in his own house actually. So we'll send him home. 
let's go and see if he has got a PC. Oh, yeah, there he has. So let's get him going on that. Playing The Sims, that is going to take us, or him, 54 minutes. So you complete that, and we must be pretty much on track now. We're 93%. So maybe this is the last thing possibly to do. I'm not sure. We'll come back in a little while, and we'll see. And there we go. Play Sims on a PC is now complete. And I think, oh, yeah, there we go. Congratulations. You have just unlocked the ability to turn toddlers into preteens. Excellent. So the task is complete. I have really enjoyed that task. I have so enjoyed having a, a time limit free one. Yeah, so preteen adoption. Congratulations. You can now adopt preteen Sims using the telephone. Ooh, okay. So our next quest that comes available is Seuss Judgmental. A restaurant is available to buy in Sim Town. It's a little run down though. The previous owner was determined to see it didn't fall into the hands of undeserving Sims. So we we're going to get on with that new quest. If you want to see the preparing for preteens task list, I'll put the link down below for my uh, blog post about it. If that's easier for you. And I will see you guys for Seuss Judgmental very soon. Bye. Thanks for watching.